What's up guys, what is good? So today I'll be showing you guys top 3 sneakers you need for back to school. I know some people already started school, some are about to start this week. For myself, I started school already. But um, anyways, let's hit up the first sneaker that I'll be showing you guys. Alright, so number one on the list, it's a type of sneaker that you're gonna wear on your first day of school. It's a type of sneaker that you're gonna break next. Make people look down on your feet, make them go side to side on their necks, you know, and make them go damn all the time. And for me, I chose the Nike Air more up tempo. You got this big block of white right here that reads air. And it's just totally noticeable with this colorway, the Olympic colorway. You got the contrasting color between the navy and the white, which really make people look down on your feet. Most likely this sneaker only released every four years, every summer Olympics, because that's when Scottie Pippen wear these sneakers, the Olympic colorway. Alright, so number two on the list, it's a type of sneaker that you're gonna be wearing every day. Now, I know some people prefer comfort, some people prefer style, you know, but it all depends on the person. Now, for me, I chose the Adidas MDs. Now, I don't have the Adidas Ultra Boost to compare how comfortable the two are, but for now, these NMDs are comfortable for me. And also, you got this nice clean colorway, nice clean silhouette. You know, the style of this sneaker is just clean and simple. And for me, it's just something that you could wear every day. You can dress up and you can dress down with this sneaker. And the third on the list, it's a type of sneaker that you're gonna need when it's cold outside, when it's snowing. I live in Winnipeg and the winter here are just crazy insane. Most likely when it's January and February, that's when the temperature really goes down to the point that you don't even want to leave the house, you don't even want to leave your bed. And for me, I chose the Chuck Taylor All-Star. Now some of you might be wondering why I did not choose the Timberland. That is because they are expensive. It ranged from 210 to 220 to 40 Canadian. And you know, that is just too much for me. And I really want the classic colorway on the Timberland, but they never go on sale. So that is why I chose this Chuck Taylor because they are cheaper. I don't know if these are gonna be available in stores this winter. Cause I've actually had this for like two or three years now and it's still brand new but um i feel like this is the year that i will be needing to wear this because i don't have any winter shoes out anymore and there you guys have it the top three sneaker you need for back to school first it's a sneaker that you're gonna be wearing on your first day of school and break next once a while second it's a sneaker that you're gonna be wearing every day style comfort it all depends on you and third is a sneaker that you're gonna need when it's winter time even if you live in an area that doesn't snow, it is something that you can use to style up once in a while. There you guys have it. The top 3 sneakers that you need for back to school. I hope you guys like this video and if you guys do, please click the like button down below. And also if you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to click the subscribe button down below too. And also leave me a comment. And also follow me on my Instagram. It's at kickitwith.cj. I will put the link down below on the description box and you guys can just click and follow me. But anyways guys, this is Kick It With CJ signing out. Peace!